Greetings YouTube and welcome to another 100 premium disappointment crystal opening. Something that other than one time in the past three or four months has been my best luck. Uh, well, I guess unless you take into account that five star cinematic crystal where I pulled the Killmonger. I haven't pulled Stark Spidey, but I have pulled just about everybody else that I've wanted out of that five star crystal. And I'm very thankful for that. Uh, but yeah, we, uh, we're always looking to get, you know, two to three, uh, four stars out of these. You'll remember that the, uh, the drop rates are 2%. So on average, even though each crystal is technically a coin flip, uh, independently of each other, you should get about two, four stars for every hundred. So, uh, as always, we're going to do 10 batches of 10. I've got 50 shard crystals that I've formed and also 50, uh, complete crystals mostly from the five star featured arena so if you are always wondering how i open premium so fast it is arena 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 that is the secret to my success from the twenty six thousand units you see in the top right to the battle chips to iso everything comes from arena i grind until i hate my life but it's so worth it all right let's open uh, five batches of 10 and then go to the fully formed and open five more and the first one we see any four stars uh, I see a bunch of two-star trash. By the way, if you see one new, that just might be a new four-star champion. But, oh, hello, right off the bat, uh, Phoenix as a four-star amongst two-star trash. Now that is what I'm talking about, a great start. Remember, we just went on average the drop rate of two four-stars per hundred, and we got one in the first, uh, first ten. Okay, well... Let's see if we can keep it going, shall we? Back-to-back -back four stars to open this opening? That'd be pretty cool. And, of course not. But uh, we do have a bunch of two-stars, including two two-star visions, I see. And uh, you know what's really interesting is we have gotten zero three-stars. We've gotten more four-stars than three-stars in the first 20 crystals. Well, let's see if we get a three-star here in our third batch of ten. And the Kabam RNG has given us a magic touch, as we do see one there. And also, we have 2020 Vision. Well, that is uh, two three stars. That's, I think, about the drop rate. And uh, two more rounds of 10. See what happens. Uh, two star trash floating the screen again. And there is our Black Panther, who also is a max sig. We have two four stars in the first 40. That is about as good as we can see it. And uh, wow. There's that Max Sig crystal as well. This is so fantastic. Well, we could get uh, nothing in our next, what, 60 and still get the drop rate. But let's get greedy and see if we get another four star, shall we? And I see a couple of three stars, a uh, Jane Foster and a Nebula to be exact. And we'll take those uh, Max Sig crystals for the three stars, certainly. All right, well, two four stars in the first uh, 50. That is amazing. That would give us four four stars at this rate if the 50 that we've saved here keep up, but one would think that would not be the case. But hey, there's only one way to find out. So let's pop these uh, last 50 and see what happens. Come on, one new, right? We're getting that super duper fun lag, that uh, North Star of Death. Oh, good. We have... Uh, Problems connecting to the network. What I usually like to do in this case is wait about 10 seconds. Oh, there we go. And then and then reset the router, right? Um, okay, so a bunch of two-star trash. And this time there's no four-star at the end, but we do have a three-star dorm. So, so far, about what's to be expected. I hope this problem's connecting to network goes away. All right, can we get a third four-star? Yes, we can, and it is someone that you can be attracted to because it's Magneto. Very weird phrase, but you get what I'm saying. Third, four-star, more premium, four-star luck in 100. I have just been killing it with this opening. It has been by far the best series that I've done in terms of beating the RNG besides getting not one but two 1.5% RNG for that four-star Korg. So um, can we get a fourth? We already have... Gotten one more four star than the average two out of a hundred RNG. So uh, let's see. Do I hear a fourth four star? Nope. See a bunch of two stars. But maybe there's someone hiding at the end. Up oh, there's a three star rogue and a three star cyclops. Can't complain about those. 
two more batches of 10. As a reminder, if you ever see anybody just spin out premiums, that is a waste of your life. Certainly ain't nobody got time for that. Uh, okay, there's a three-star Yellow Jacket. Anything hiding at the end? There's a three-star Colossus. I will not get excited about that, and that's it. All right, one more chance, but again, I just more premium luck. That's all I can say. I am getting so lucky with these crystals. It is unbelievable, and I'm very thankful for that. We're ending with a bunch of two stars. Kabam's kind of like, hey, we don't want you to get too excited, but maybe, just maybe, there is something at the end of this. Let's see. And a three-star Gamut and three-star Wolverine. Okay, well, three four stars in 100 premiums. I am always so incredibly thankful for that. So um, I hope that your luck goes well. I've had people message me with pictures of getting three four stars in 10 crystals, which I've still never done. And also people who've said they haven't got a, a single four star. I think I said three three stars, three four stars in 100 crystals. Um, I said, I've had people who haven't given me uh, any indication they've gotten a four star within 500 premiums. I think that's a little crazy, but maybe you're one of those people. Either way, let me know what you've been doing lately in the premium disappointment crystals. I am so pumped that I beat that 2% RNG again and got a three out of 100 or 3% RNG for the four star. Thanks again for watching YouTube. I always appreciate your support.